All right, here we are again. Championship we haven't raced for a season or two. The IR04 Fix Series. And we're up Bathurst. Me, any excuse to race Bathurst is a good excuse. Not sure what split we're in, but on car 10 and I qualified 11th after completely messing up my qualifying. I left it too late to go out and I was just approaching the last corner as the time I ran out. So I should have been a few places further up. Definitely haven't got the pace of the top guys though. They're ridiculously fast. Sure, why we got such a big gap behind us? Maybe a few cars starting from the pit lane. Twenty-one cars in this race. Let's see how many make it to the end of the first lap. The track temp is twenty. The air temp is eighteen Celsius. P eleven. All right, John. Be ready. Green, green, green. There's an incident in Hell Corner. It looks like it's Noturno. 20 minutes remaining. You've got 20 minutes left. Car left. Be back in Hold your line. Hold your line. Still there. Still there. Clear left. On your left. Hold your line. Clear left. Good start. Keep it up. Car right. Clear right. Just didn't want to run into the back of that Porsche. Or well, the Porsche delivered car, I should say. What are you doing? Oh, you hit the wall. Oh, there's a big crash behind. There's a big pile up in the dipper. That's took the pressure off from beyond. McNally is now in the lead. Come on, have a nice safe first lap and let's go from there. Right side. Clear right. P8. P8. Ben R4. Noturno is leading the race. Right side. Still there. Clear right. Uh, give him the corner.
God, we all made a mistake. <laughs> he does not want to give me the draft. I'm going to hit the limiter before I get past him, so... There you go. Now I'm in the limiter. Bit too short on the gearing to make take advantage down that strike. The leader's just done a 209.4. behind has just done a 208.6. Jeez, the guy behind is really fast. It's nearly seven seconds behind that. Don't kill me. Clear left. Thank you. 15 minutes remaining. 15 minutes to go. Okay, John. There'll be chances here. Let's make sure we can take them. Brilliant. Nice one. Come on. The gap behind is now 0.8. Poor corner, that last one. These guys are really fighting ahead. Come on. This lap for 208.3. Uh. P9. Come on, man. This is disappointing. There's decent pace in this car. The guy ahead's lap time is a 207.7. I'm not sure if I just trail braked into the corner or something. I just carried a bit too much speed. Take either way. Best part, 12 minutes left. Still plenty of time for something to happen. The leader has just done a 208.0.
car in front is pitting. That's good for us. P8. That means that silly mistake has only cost me one place. I was in P7 when I spun. Lucky not to get damaged. Need to get my head back down. All right, John, 10 minutes to go. That's 10 minutes left. That's half distance. You're looking good for fuel. Is now 6.3 seconds. It might be fast, but he's hit the wall. I should be back up to P7 now. is Skurlock, fastest lap for McNally, 207.7. Seventh position, your lap time was at 210.3, the car behind's pitting. He was damaged. Ten seconds beyond the cars ahead. He did a two twelve last lap. The gap to Skurlock ahead is increasing. It's now ten seconds. Got to keep going. You never know what's going to happen. Got to practice that current corner. Okay, John, Ooh, don't you do that. Off your fuel. McNally is now leading. Really good racing guys, nice and clean, apart from me, thank you. <laughs> the car behind is reeling you in, the gap is now 3.6. Uh, He's quicker than you into the S's, you've just done a 210.4. No room around this corner, Mike. Two seconds a lap quicker, that's not good.
Okay, John, you've got 10 minutes of fuel remaining. He is absolutely flying behind me. Trouble is, he's bringing a few of the cars with him. Five minutes remaining, five minutes left. The leader's just done a 207.7. Tenth off in sector one. Sector two is 1.1 off the pace. Sector three is 0.6 off the pace. One point one quick as that lap. Do you need to hit beach? Yeah, it's going to be right on me on the last lap if I don't get a move on. I'll go on the beach. That was a lot of understeer. behind is now 1.6 Sorry man, I'm out of control now That's a new fastest lap for Harvey 207.6 You can have it man, I'm going to end up crashing if I keep driving like that there's an incident in Forest Elbow. We think it might be Gil. <laughs> That's a new fastest lap for McNally, 207.3. The leader has just done a 207.5. <laughs> Just going into there again. I have to defend. I have to go a long way. Left side. Hold your line. Still there. Hold your line. Still there. Clear left. Two minutes to go. Two minutes. Oh, I managed to defend it. It close up. I 
Okay, John. We estimate you've got five minutes of fuel remaining. Last lap. I'm going to take the inside of the line again. Car left. Hold your line. Clear left. On your left. Oh, you might have got it done this time. Hold your line. Still there. Still there. Hold your line. Making it work for it. Hold your line. Clear <laughs> left. <laughs> Oh man, I didn't expect that. Looks like P3's gone off in Forrest's elbow. Done enough to stay ahead. Two liters left. Gil has just been disqualified. And where was Gil? Well, guys, really good race. Looks like P2's gone off in hell corner. Car right, clear right. Oh, he spun it. P6. Okay, it's over. Well done, mate. Good finish. P6? Oh, I didn't expect that. I had to work for that one. P6. Oof. That was a heck of a lot of defending for the last two laps. I have to say, fair play to Pedro here. I absolutely enjoyed these last two laps. It was miles faster than me, but I just had to defend like my life depended on it. And he really did make me work for it. I knew he was going to get the better run. <laughs> Excuse me. I knew he was going to get the better run down this straight. So I just defended the inside line. Most of the movements. And he got ahead of me there, but just a little bit deep in the corner. Allow me to come back round the outside, giving each other plenty of room. I have to say that's really fair by Pedro. He could have squeezed me out in all sorts. I just had to park the car exactly where he wanted to be. This is a real tough track to pass on. He was miles quicker than me. Give him a clean lap, he'd just leave me for dust. He just kept running wide there, though. If he kept under my wing, he would have been past me. So he gets a good draft of me down here. 
but you're running to the rev limiter. There you go. He breaks later than me. Carries a bit more speed through the corner. So again, I'll just park the car on the inside. Let him know I'm going to defend. And he just touches the grass. And that was it. Right, let's have a look at all the crashes. Oh, and that banging wheels. That's never good. Oh, that's the big crash. Right, let's have a look what happened. Oh, he just lost it, spun. And just ended up blocking the track. How did he get there? Oh, that was me going for a spin. Oh, he did clip my wing. Yep, front wing damage. Oh, somebody spun behind me.
Right, that's the end of the race. Let's go and check the results. We were in split two or three. Safety rating up by 0 0.09. Thanks to the two X in the race. Two X or three X? Two X. Our rating up by 46, but to 17.45. It's quite good. We were car number 10, started 11th and finished in 6th despite the spin. Our fastest lap was a 2.090 and the fastest lap of the race was a 2.072. We're a good chunk off the pace. Right, if you enjoyed that race, Hopefully I shall see you on the next one.